This is an update for the Ross Industrial Consortium's Scan and Plan for Robotic Blending Project, Milestone 3, sponsored by the Boeing Company and Caterpillar. Surface blending is currently an exhausting process. Workers who blend parts by hand often suffer from repetitive stress injuries. The scan and plan process allows a human operator to select eligible parts in a robot's workspace, and the software takes over, automatically generating tooling paths and robot trajectories, executing them, and even quality assuring them. So here's an example of the scan and plan software running on actual hardware. In the first step of the process, the user instructs the robot to scan its work cell using an RGB depth camera on the end effector. The robot takes several pictures at different angles in the cell and then assembles those pictures or those images into eligible surfaces, no CAD required. And a second later, the robot has generated Cartesian paths and robot trajectories for both the blending process and the QA process, which is accomplished with a blue laser line scanner. In the next step, the operator can simulate the generated robot trajectories to make sure that everything seems reasonable. When the simulation is finished, the operator, can instruct, the operator instructs the robot to execute the processes. Here you see it go first going down, or going to the first service and executing a blend, followed up by inspection on the same surface. It orients the laser line scanner to the surface and rasterizes it. The operator can actually watch as the data shows up the QA scores live inside the operator's window. The setting for what makes a good surface is configurable inside the software. In between each process, the robot returns to a safe home position. When it's finished with the first surface, it goes down to the second. The robot trajectories you see here are generated with a Descartes Cartesian Path Planner, which guarantees optimum smooth trajectories that avoid collisions, joint limits, and singularities. Note the tilted orientation of the surface. We can currently handle flat surfaces at arbitrary size, position, and angle. We anticipate support for more complex surfaces in the next milestone. Here on the second scan, Notice that the robot intelligently attempts to minimize cycle time by scanning along the major axis of the surface. And now the process is complete. One of the great things about the Ross Industrial Consortium is that it fosters a collaborative environment for technology transfer. We're grateful to the team of developers that helped make this project successful. Hello, my name is Adam Clark. I'm from the Boeing Company. I helped integrate the blending software on the EBB robot. Hi, my name is Matt West and I work for Caterpillar. I worked on the integration of the laser profilometer. Hi, my name is Chris Sketch from Caterpillar. I worked on adding edge detection to the service scans. My name is Zach Bennett. I'm with Wolf Robotics. I worked with process control. For more information, visit rossindustrial.org. The source code can be found at the consortium repository.